New tonight, the family of a man who was shot and killed by Phoenix police over the weekend says that they now plan to sue the department over his death. 34 year old Ali Osman was killed after police say he threw rocks at officers and did not obey commands to stop. Team 12's Chase Go Lightly spoke with Osman's family this afternoon about the loss of their loved one. Hard to sleep, hard to just do anything. A struggle to move forward from heartbreak. We just spoke to him a couple of days ago and now he's gone. It's the family of Ali Osman sharing memories of him. He just wanted to help everybody in the world. Yeah. A loving person also. Loving person. Wishing they had more time together. I missed him. If he was here, I would just give him a hug. I'd really feel it. I'm never going to have that opportunity again and it hurts. Those closest to him say Osman struggled with mental health but was getting treatment in Phoenix. It was Saturday night when Phoenix police say the 34 year old was throwing rocks at their cruiser at Tucky and 19th Avenue, just south of Glendale Avenue. They approached Osman and told him to stop. Police say he continued when both officers shot and killed him. The whole thing just makes no sense to me. He didn't deserve this. This should not have resulted in Ollie's death. There were several things that could have been done. Now his family has hired local attorney Quasi Smith to represent them in a lawsuit against the department, saying this shooting that ended Osman's life was unjustified. I haven't heard anything that would even suggest to me remotely as a former police officer that these officers conduct was acceptable. Phoenix police tell us the size of the rocks thrown is still under investigation, but will be revealed along with the body cam footage two weeks after the shooting per the department's transparency policy. Both officers involved are also on leave. While there are still so many questions and a long road ahead, Osman's family says they will not stop. All of us are going to always be there for him. Till my last dollars in my bank account to fight for him. I don't care what I have to do. I'll do everything for Ollie. And we will get justice. In Phoenix, Chase Golightly, 12 News.